Hello friends, today I am going to be speaking on how to overcome fear. First of all, I am going to tell you a small story about myself and how I overcame my own fear. There was a time when as a family we went to a swimming pool and all of us were, all the people, my husband, my daughter, we were all enjoying in the water. Then we decided to go on the slide. As I came down the slide, as everyone was uh, playing in the water, I overturned and fell into the water. When I fell into the water, a deep fear of water came into me and I never wanted to go into the water again. And years passed by and uh, a few years ago, the fear remained and uh, one day my daughter, now she's married, and we have a son-in-law and they just asked me, ki, uh, Mama, would you like to go scuba diving? Now scuba diving is definitely inside the water, deep down. And knowing my fear, I said, yes, I would like to go. After that, I was just sitting and I was saying, how am I going to go when I'm so scared of water? One thing I realized to myself, I started telling myself, that even if I go in the water, the people who take us in the water must be having some equipment to not allow us to drown. And I started imagining myself as going under the water, seeing the fishes and enjoying. And started building, instead of fear, the same feelings, I started replacing it with excitement. The day came that we went into the water and we went scuba diving and I was able to go deep down, watch the fishes and come up. My daughter, my son, my husband, they were so surprised that how did you manage to overcome your fear? I realized that there were some steps to it. So fear is natural. It is when we perceive danger, we have certain feelings inside us which rise up, which make us feel very scared. That is fear. It is real. It is real for everyone. Everyone has different types of fear. It can be rational, it can be irrational, but it is definitely there. It can be water, it can be disease, it can be some report of the doctor. It can be some fear that you have heard on the media of a cyclone coming, asteroids coming, some fear of death, something that or of animals or any other fear like that. Something maybe even as simple as not being able to take medicines orally. Even that is a small fear, but it is a fear. It's a real fear for the person who is going through it. So these are the different types of fears that we have. Let's look at some tips from my story of how to overcome fear. First tip, we need to realize, we need to recognize that we have the fear. So we need to identify and recognize our fear that this is my fear. In my story, it was the fear of water. Second, the second tip is to admit it to yourself. I admitted it to myself that for years I had been carrying that same fear. But I also admitted it to myself that I need to overcome it. So that is the step two, that you need to admit your fear, fears. Third tip, the tip number three is face the fears. Once I had admitted my fears and made up my mind to get over it, then I decided to face it. And when the opportunity came by, I said yes to scuba diving, which I had never done before. And I knew it was in deep waters. So, facing your fears. Step number four. You know, fear and excitement, both of them have the same feelings. You have butterflies in your stomach and you feel so scared to do something. But in the case of fear, it is all negative oriented. And it is learned through circumstances and things that you've gone through. Whereas excitement is positive, where you're looking forward to doing something. It is a very good way to trick your mind, which I did. 
you trick your mind to say that I am going to enjoy something which you are actually scared to do. So when you tell your mind the opposite and start looking forward to doing something, you are actually going face on to move into the fear and to do to attack the fear and to get into it. So that is the step number four. Okay. Then you also need to know that you can live one day at a time knowing that no matter what the future holds for me, life is an adventure and I am going to live it at the fullest. That gives you a different feeling to fight fear. Fear is real, but if you can think of how to fight this fear and to overcome it, then you will be able to move forward. The next tip is also you can take help from people or get a knowledge about how others have braved this fear. Or you can even look back into your own life at times when there have been fearful situations and you have fought it. The main thing is to realize that you are going to tell your mind to come into control and fight this fear and go forward. Thank you so much. I'm sure you like my video. If you've done so, please subscribe and share. Thank you. Like, share and subscribe.